I was jogging in Manhattan Beach and I started feeling a little tired. Uh, my legs were a little sluggish, something that I had never really felt before. And then a week later, I started noticing that I, as I started my run, I started feeling like I was losing my breath. I decided to naturally make an appointment to see my doctor and he explained about me having an enlarged heart. He explained about the fact that I was suffering from congestive heart failure along with AFib and that my heart as an athlete, I just wore it out. And the first thing he said is, well, I looked at your case and you look like a perfect candidate for a transplant. And I said, you, you're talking to me? I said, wait a minute, I've never had any kind of issue with this all through my life. Why now? Unlike other tissues or other organs in the body where uh, damage can be repaired and replaced by new tissue, Unfortunately, the regenerative capacity of the heart is lost. The muscle of the heart is replaced by scar tissue, and that scar tissue is permanent. What we're trying to do in our laboratory is try to see how we can teach the cardiomyocytes or those muscle cells in the heart to undergo division to replace the scar tissue with new muscle cells. You can think of it as a replacement for heart transplantation. Rather than doing a, an entire organ transplantation, we're actually transplanting cells to replace the scar. Mr. Kulta was on one hand very advanced and rapidly progressive in his heart failure condition. On the other hand, because of a very healthy lifestyle over decades, in a position to go through the transplantation process in a meaningful way. Everything came through with flying colors. It was such a wonderful experience, believe it or not. I want to be at UCLA. If I need a new heart, if I need a new anything, I want to be at UCLA because they, they treat you like family. There are nearly six million people with heart failure in this country. And I'm hoping that our research will contribute to changing the path of heart failure as, a, as an end stage disease, as an intractable disease to something that can be managed without subjecting patients to so much misery and so much invasive procedures. This is my home. This is where I know the type of researchers that come through a school like UCLA. So I know, like any other thing that UCLA does, it's amongst the best. And I think that was one of the things that I felt confident in coming to UCLA. So I was in the best place possible.